In this video, you will learn about regression in R and how to draw best fit line or regression line. You will see illustration of regression, its simple definition, and the model summary, including residuals, coefficients, intercept, slope, adjusted R square, etc. And all this in a very simple way. If you want to learn R programming, statistics, data science, please subscribe our channel PyDemi, like, share, and press the bell icon to get the latest videos about the topic. Thank you. Now, what is a linear regression? Uh, a regression is a statistical measurement that attempts to determine the strength of relationship between a dependent variable, usually denoted by Y, which is called the uh, criterion variable and a series of other changing variables known as independent variables or predictor. This is a model of simple linear regression in which we have one independent variable and only one dependent variable and we want to check the relationship of this independent variable with this dependent variable. First we will download the sample data file Faculty Marshall USC Advertisement Advertising CSV. It will open this site and select the first advertising.csv. It will start downloading. And uh, when it is downloaded, open this file and then select this first column, right click and delete. So there are four columns, TV, radio, newspaper, and sales. Now save this file and save as advertising and extension will be CSV and save it on uh, D drive or E drive or anywhere else. Okay. Now I have saved this file on my D drive. Now here, um, an airs variable or object is assigned the data from this file, read.csv to read this file and this is the file name with expansion and path and we, when we run it, okay, the file is read. Now if you want to view the contents of this file, you can use capital V, I, E, W, U, parenthesis and the object name adds and it will show you the contents of file, TV, radio, newspaper and sales. Similarly, you can find the number of rows in your file and in your data frame and number of columns and that is four. Then you can go for call names, column names and it will show you TV, capital T, capital V, radio, newspaper and sales. There are four columns. Now we are going to create two variables. First one is uh, TV and the second one is sales. TV is assigned the column TV of our data frame ads and sales is assigned the column sales. To bring clarity and TV and sales two columns are created. Next we are going to use the plot function. Plot function takes two variables. First one is the X variable that is TV the independent variable and second one is the dependent variable that is y variable and when we run this one plot is created and we can see zoom and this is plot but this is very simple plot in black and white without any labels and uh, other things now if you want to create a colorful and more attractive graph here plot here same plot function and first two uh, um, arguments are same here tv and uh, sales next one is pch is equal to 16. this is about the uh, type of plotting either it is a square a circle or a triangle or a dotted line etc so pch is equal to 16 draws filled small circles sex is the cex is the size of circle one is the uh, smallest size color the color of 
plot, uh, scatter plot the points and that is blue. Main is equal to TV versus sales means the main heading. And X label TV of course and Y label sales. Now to run this one and this is graph. Now these are circles and color circles. This is main TV versus sales. This is sales and this is TV X and variables. Now next here we are creating a variable object model is assigned LM. Linear model means linear regression and in this regression in this model first we will write the Y variable dependent variable or the dependent variable and then tilde and then the independent variable and if we run this model okay the model is run and uh, okay first if we run this simple linear model and the output is just like a simple call linear model formula sales dependent variable and tv is independent coefficients this is the y intercept 7.03 and this is the slope for uh, tv plot line that is the slope and this is the y intercept to have a detailed version what you can do is summary you can run this code summary parenthesis model and it will return now you can see here uh, residuals minimum first quartile medium third quartile maximum to have a view about your data then coefficients intercept and uh, tv slope standard error then t value then p value you ought to know about these values because this video is about plotting plotting um, regression scatter plot and doing regression in R. It's not out in general what is statistics. Then there is a residual error, then 198 degrees of freedom. This is R squared, this is adjusted R squared 0.6099, F statistics 312. Next is uh, try writing attributes parenthesis model and run it. It will give you uh, names of different attributes, coefficient, residuals, effects, model, terms, call, etc. You can see each and every one of this like coefficients, uh, coefficients of model and you will see this one intercept and TV. These are the coefficients. This is slope and this is intercept. Similarly, you can write uh, instead of coefficients, you can write COEF model and it will return the same output like this one. And now uh, to create regression line or best fit line, you will write AB line and parenthesis and within parenthesis model, we want to draw a regression line for this model for that drawing and when you will run this one and uh, you can see this is the best fit line drawn uh, with the help of least square method this is how you can draw best fit line or regression line in next video i will tell you about how to do multiple stepwise regression to select different important variables in your model. If you like the video, please subscribe our channel PyDemi and wait for the next video. Thank you.